the journey begins for me out and about in the city. I've got my sketchbook in hand and I've got my pens with me. I take them everywhere I go. It's the vibrancy of London that really excites me. I walk the streets of the city to get inspired, to see things that are interesting and exciting, things that are mundane, things that are ordinary. You've got to keep your eyes open when you're a sketcher. So first up, find something that's unusual or different or something that catches your eye. I think fundamentally you've got to be excited about what you're drawing. What you want is the drawing to do something different to a photograph. You know, we're not trying to get a photographic reference, so what we're trying to do is an artistic interpretation. Kind of sketch, actually tell a different story about that building or the subject matter that you're looking at. You're in a really mindful moment when you're drawing, just absolutely in the moment. You are not thinking about anything else. You're thinking about the subject matter, trying to bring it onto the page. I love that feeling, I love that feeling. I also love the feeling that when you start out drawing, you never really know what's gonna happen. I've no idea if it's gonna end up being a great sketch or not. There's always that kind of like tension, which is kind of quite exciting. I do like the, the stage of the process where I've maybe spent a bit of time away from the sketch, so I'm maybe back in my studio and I'm now maybe adding colour or I'm adding more detail. You see the, the sketch blossom, you sort of see it come to life. In your mind's eye you, you can sort of see that picture emerging. Adding people into your drawings really brings the architecture to life because you know buildings are built for people in the first instance, right? And I'm interested in the, the part that they play in our lives and kind of how we all interact with buildings and urban environments. It's not just about the buildings for me, it's about the kind of the cities in which the buildings live and the people that work and live in those buildings. I love that story. <laughs>